Okay, so here we go. Hey, what's up everybody? This is Tyler from 10thumbspro.com coming at you with another lesson. Today we're doing I'm Yours, the easier beginner strummer version, all right? So you can go ahead and look for the advanced version on Saturday Saturday and B. But if you just got your ukulele, let's say it's Christmas time, you love this song, you want to learn it, I'm going to break this down as easy as possible to get you playing this song in no time, all right? 10thumbspro.com, check the links below so you can get involved and help us grow. But if you came just because that ukulele is yours and you want to break it down, that's cool, I dig it and I respect it. I want you to grab your ukulele, brain attention span, follow me on in and let's break this lesson down right now. All right, time to break down I'm Yours by Jason Mraz. Now remember, this is the beginner easy version. We will be dropping the full version in B major this Saturday, but this is going to be a simple version for any of you out there that got the ukulele and you're just beginning, but you really like the song and you want to play along with it. <clears throat> we are going to need a C major. All right, ring finger, third fret. G major, pointer finger, second fret, second fret, C string, middle finger, third fret, E string, Mid I'm sorry, middle finger, second fret, A string, your ring finger will be the third fret, E string, A minor, middle finger, second fret, G string, and an F major, which is going to be the same as our A minor, but we're going to put our pointer finger on the first fret of the E string. And later, we're also going to need something called an E diminished, and that's a little later. Okay, now, the, the idea is to go from one measure of C to one of G to one of A minor to one of F. So if you were to count it, it would go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So we're going to play it like this. Alright, now make sure at this point, if you're a true beginner, that you're able to strum the chords and count to four. One, two, three, four, one, two, etc. Once you get that down, let's break the strum down. What I'm doing is I'm going down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. But you'll notice the second time I go down, up, the down is a little stronger. Down, up, 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 down, up. And this happens four times over each chord. So over only the C would look like this. Down, up, 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 down, up. Then you would switch to the G. Down, up, 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 down. A minor. Down, up, down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, F. Alright, so what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to put that together and I'm going to play through this loop three times in a row. Your goal should be to play along with me and try to keep the rhythm the whole time, okay? So here we go.
And believe it or not, that is 99.9% .9 of the song. There's one other little part that I'm going to show you right now. All right, so that's it. That's the entire rhythm. Go ahead and put that to the lyrics and you have the song, all right? Now, there's one other part, that part where it goes, it should be love, 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 love. And what we're doing there is we're going through the loop. Like normal. Singing those lyrics. When we get to this part. So God forsake and ride to me, love, 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 love. And what we're doing here is we're making a chord called an E diminished. Middle finger, first fret, ring finger, middle finger, first fret of the C string, ring finger, first fret of the A string. And you're gonna let that one just play. One, two, three, four. And then you go right back into the rhythm, all right? So if you run through that really quick. is I'm yours. Get that under your fingers, practice it, because we're also doing the advanced version in the key of B minor as well. Alright? But go ahead, if you're a beginner, really get this one under your fingers so you can play it, so you have it down, so you feel comfortable with it before you go ahead and move on. Alright? 10thumbspro.com, thumbs up if it helped you, and until next time, playing ukulele. Keep letting us know what you want to learn and we're going to do our best to help you out. All right. Cheers and take care of yourselves. All right. I'm yours. Now you got it. I know a lot of you probably bought this uk your ukulele just to play the song. It was so popular. Super uber mega hit. Millions and millions of copies sold. And now you got it. You can play it on ukulele. People are going to go, oh dude, I'm yours. And you go, yeah, I know. 10 That's how I learned it. Boom. Check it out. And we all win. All right. Okay. And until next time, big thumbs up. A big hug from us to you. Take care. And ukulele bless.